Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to a new video. everybody and welcome back to a new video today is currently Friday and I have showered I'm dressed ready for the day cozy attire of course because today I'm spending most of it probably editing well, not most of it but a good portion of the morning I'll be editing and I'm 12 minutes into a 59 minute video where Larry my mom and myself decorated the house for fall and Halloween so that's super cozy that's already out that will be going out Saturday you guys will be seeing this on Monday so yeah, it, I love the vlog. It's very chatty, which I like. And today, oh, <laughs> we have the Fall Bath and Body Works haul that I'm gonna share with you guys. As you know, Bath and Body Works puts their candles on sale in the fall and it's very exciting because instead of, I think it's $24.99 or $22.99, the candles will go on sale for like 11 something. So I picked out a few candles and a few soaps so I'm going to share those with you guys in this video. And yeah, if you bought, let me know in the comments below what scents you got from Bath and Body, Work, Body Works this fall. And there was one candle that I wanted really bad. It's called Honey Crisp. Completely sold out. Can't get it. So I'm going to go back and check just because Honey Crisp is my favorite apple ever. Like it's the only ones that I buy. Unfortunately, they're the most expensive apple for some reason. Maybe because they're so but, um, but yeah, so that's what we're going to do. And then we're just going to chill, hang around the house. I need to tidy up a little bit. So we might do some of that as well. And skin update. <laughs> oh, we've got spot here, big old spot there, a spot there. So my skin is definitely, definitely not happy and see let me explain to you guys too so i had clear skin uh and before that i had really bad hormonal acne all through here like cystic deep hormonal acne and i tried everything over the counter that's topical and then i even tried topical stuff from the doctor and it didn't work um the only thing that works mine is a hormonal issue so the only thing that works is going i guess inside and doing medication so we're back to breakouts, but that's okay. You know, we do what we can do. We deal with it. It's normal. It's part of life. You know, when you're going on 29, you think, oh, I'm going to have beautiful, clear skin in my 30s. No, <laughs> you still get acne in your 30s. Well, some of us do. Uh, so yeah, it is what it is. So I've just tossed my hair back in a clip. I think I'm going to make a shake. Babe, do you want to make breakfast? What do we want? Sausage. Do we still have any bacon or no? No, so Okay. So I think what I'm going to do is make a green smoothie. Give my skin and body a healthy green situation. <laughs> and I really think I need to cut back on dairy. Um, so yeah, that's, what, that's, that's the plan for the day. That's the little chat. But I'm going to get back to editing this video. And I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Hi, baby. <laughs> Hi. The whole time I wasn't recording. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
while I edit videos, recently I've been really loving on Pandora. That's what I use, but it's called Disney Peaceful Radio, and it's just so nice. So they have a mixture of piano. No, it's called Disney Peaceful Piano Radio. So anything Disney, I thumbs up, and then I get to listen um, to power off. <laughs> my Bluetooth shut off because I wasn't using it. Um, yeah, there's just really amazing songs on here. I just like to listen to music while I work. I'm one of those that when I'm editing, I like to have music in the background or a film in the background, at least a film that I've seen two million times so that it doesn't distract me. I don't know. I'm just one of those people that has to have like noise in the background. My mom does that too. However, if I read a book, it has to be dead silent. If there is a TV on, I will start trying to read a line and I'll be listening to the TV and like start saying what the TV is saying. So that's the only time that I cannot have background noise unless it's like cozy, low, soft piano or crackling fire in the background. Let me know if you guys are the same way. I don't know. It's interesting. So anyways, let's get to editing. my gosh, I'm editing the part of the vlog where I thought it was Binks meowing from Hocus Pocus and it was Luna meowing. Poor baby. Gracious, what's a storm? All right, oh my gosh. This weather's a bit crazy today. My hair's crazy, the weather's crazy, you know. What can we do? All right guys, so my video is currently saving. It's 25% uploaded. You guys will be seeing it on, let me come a little closer. You guys will be, this is my favorite weather ever. Oh my gosh, it is currently 106 in Florida in the afternoon and it is just hammering down with a big thunderstorm and it's been consistently raining for, I'd say at least two hours now. I was going to film this where I usually film in the living room, but the living room is like pitch black. Let me show you what it looks like. Well, it's not pitch black, but that's how dark it is because of the storm. Oh my. It's okay, kitty. All right. So if you hear thunder and lightning, if you hear rain, it's 
definitely raining. But I figured, here we are. While the video is uploading, I would do the Bath and Body Works haul with you guys, which I'm very excited for. Fall is my number one season besides Christmas. Storm's living on top of us. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight candles to get through. The first, which is a new one this year, I believe, is called Acorn Lane. Let's take a whiff. And then we'll go through our uh, keynotes. So, this smells like you're walking through the crispy leaves in the woods, and there's like fresh balsam nearby. Acorns are on the ground, and it's very damp and wet. That's what this smells like. Autumn leaves, warm cinnamon, and crisp gala apples. This I would 100% repurchase, and I can't wait to burn that one. Our next one, how cute is it? It's fresh fall morning, and I love the tree design. I'm gonna guess this is gonna smell like balsam. No, ooh, sweet balsam. Ooh, yum. Citrus zest, zit zest, citrus zest, woodland sage, and red delicious apples. I have come to the conclusion that I love sage. Is it sage or sage? I always question that. Next, we have vanilla pumpkin marshmallow. I love the little chalkboard design. It's a little sweet. <clears throat> vanilla pumpkin marshmallow, of course. It's good, but it's, it's sweet, but I still like it. Tahitian vanilla pumpkin spice homemade marshmallow and drizzle. Dri oh my god, let me just restart that, guys. Hold on. Okay, let's pretend we know how to speak <laughs> and pronounce. Tahitian vanilla pumpkin spice homemade marshmallow and drizzled caramel. Did I say caramel or caramel? I guess it depends on the setting, doesn't it? If you want to be a little extra and a little fancy, you say caramel. <laughs> and if you know, just regular, whatever, caramel. I typically say caramel. Ooh, apple weather. Another really pretty one. <laughs> Fresh apples is exactly what this smells like. Fresh farm stand apples, lavender leaves, and cinnamon bark. Ooh, hint of lavender leaves? I don't really smell that. I do smell a dash of cinnamon, but mostly I smell fresh apples. Delicious. Okay, next, Cranberry Woods. Love the cozy fall morning kind of overlooking the mountains look. Oh, heavenlies. This is amazing. This is my favorite. Tart Cranberry, Cinnamon Bark, Forest Cedar, and Golden Amber. This one's delicious. That rain is probably freaking loud, but what can you do? I hope it sounds cozy through here. See, some it sounds cozy to me, rain patter on the window, but sometimes coming through a camera, it sounds like hissing static. <laughs> All right, next we have Cider Lane, another new scent, I believe, this year. OMG, this is the best. I smell cider, maybe a little bit of caramel but very light. I don't like super sweet candles. So, warm caramel, Granny Smith apple, dark brown sugar, and ground clove. Holy crap, that is delicious. Okay, we have two more candles. This one's very gray. Oh, marshmallow fireside, my favorite, yay! It smells like a very light campfire with marshmallows. It's delicious. <laughs> Toasted marshmallow, smoldering woods, fire roasted vanilla, crystallized with essential oils. And then the last candle we have is this one, and this is pumpkin vanilla cream. I am gonna guess this is gonna be a little sweet. Yep, quite sweet. This is a perfect kitchen candle if you're baking pumpkin bread or pumpkin rolls with cream cheese. Oh my gosh. Creamy pumpkin, vanilla cream, fresh ground nutmeg, graham cracker crust. Mmm. All right, so that is what I ordered for fall 2020 candles at Bath and Body Works. Now let's move on to the hand soaps. And this is Harvest Gathering. Keynotes, fresh picked apples, autumn berries, and clove buds. Ooh, 
Yes, love it. This is a good one. Crisp morning air. I love the light blue hint with the pretty acorns. This one is fresh pine, juniper, and juicy pear. Ooh, juicy pear sounds nice. Ooh, this smells like a fresh bath. Oh, I love it. Fresh, fresh winter, fresh morning. Morning air. Morning crisp air. I'm slurring my words. I'm getting so excited. This is great. Yeah, my hair. Eucalyptus. Vanilla eucalyptus. Now, my mom's favorite scent is the eucalyptus or the eucalyptus mint or whatever it is. I think it was eucalyptus, which used to give me headaches. For some reason, when we went to Maryland, we used the eucalyptus mint hand soap and I fell in love with it. I thought it was really cozy and relaxing and kind of like a stress relief. So I picked up the vanilla eucalyptus because vanilla is my favorite. Plus the eucalyptus, I figured it would die down that intense eucalyptus scent. So let's give it a go. Creamy vanilla eucalyptus and citrus zest. Oh my God. Yes. This, this is spa like this is zen mode you guys need it in your life zen and i got two of those so put that one there the next one is the perfect autumn morning it sounds so cute oh oh huh that smells good but i can't figure out what it smells like Fresh cranberry, spiced pumpkin, and crisp apple. I don't know how I couldn't figure out what that smelled like, but I couldn't. And then the last one is sweater weather. Ooh, that smells delicious. Smells again like kind of like woodsy campfire. Uh, sage, eucalyptus, and fresh woods. So very delicious, very excited. And that is my 2020 autumn haul. Now I do still want that Honeycrisp apple candle, so I'm going to be on the outlook for that. Outlook? Look out. Look out! I'm going to be on the lookout for that. I'm going to go check their site actually today. As long as they're on sale. I don't really care to buy them when they're full price just because I know that they go on sale and it's such a good deal. So, uh, so yeah, that was the haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I think I'm ready for lunch. It is, I told you guys it was, it's like 1.15. I'm hungry. I finished my shake, which looks disgusting now. So we need to go take that to the kitchen, wash it, and let's have some lunch. Maybe we'll have a turkey wrap. Okay, so lunch is blackberries and a turkey with Dijon mustard wrap. And then the puzzle that we were working on, I should say Larry was working on. He almost finished it, but he saved me two pieces. And then I might also have a few salts and vinegar chips. I'm putting on friends while I eat lunch. It's the best. <gasps> Lexi! <laughs> Since when do you like salt and vinegar chips? She usually sits up here with me and she does not eat off my plate like that. Are you naughty? She's stressed because of the thunder. That's what it is. No. You have to be good if you sit up here. No, Lexi. No. No. What's the matter with you today? No. And you guys are wondering where Larry is. He's um making phone calls. He's been on the phone on and off this morning. But you'll see him. to put in the last pieces. One and two. <gasps> All done. All right, so we are headed to the bedroom. I've just made my second cup of coffee for the day and I need a little caffeine boost. We're coming to the bedroom because I need to fold a load of laundry 
and then I just need to like pick up around the house and then vacuum the whole house. But I did want to show you guys the closet, which I am very, very proud of. It took me all day. You guys saw how bad the bed was two vlogs ago now. Um, so I'm going to show you what I did to the closet. I hope you guys are proud of me. I'm proud. <laughs> All right, so starting with Larry's side, we have his bowling ball, his shoes, and the step stool ladder is for things in the top shelves, which I'll show you guys in a bit. But this is his shirt section, which I organized by color and also by style. So over here is his collared shirts, more fancy. And then these are basic everyday t-shirts. Up there is his jeans section and then his dress pants section and some blankets. My side, which <laughs> is still a lot, but it is way trimmed down. There is so much more space between the hangers, which is really nice. And then again, it is color coordinated. So over here we have really delicate and like lacy sleeves and then blacks from cardigans to long sleeve shirts to sweaters. These are my really comfy, cozy um, collared kind of throwovers. So we have the teddy bear coat and then these two and then you go into like your creams and then off white slash pinky and then grays. We have a lot of gray as you guys can see. Then it moves into more creams and tans and then whites and then rainbow colors. So we have navies, greens, blues, maroon, reds into pinks orange, purple, and then we get into my t-shirts. And then over here, these are Larry's sweaters. So darks to lightest. These are a couple of dressier shirts. And then these are all of my matching bodysuits or tracksuit sets. And then this is more of like holiday stuff. Then up on top, we have the purses that I think are the cutest and decorative. So we have this lounge fly with Disney design. It's Cinderella Hedwig, which is also lounge fly, and then my guest bag. And then behind that is all my winter gloves and stuff like that that I rarely wear. Oh, I'm out of breath. Back there is purses, a bunch of them. And then we have jean shorts, jeans, and then the shoes. Lots of fall boots, shoes, hats. And then over here is my robe, Larry's robe. Oh my gosh, that was weird. My finger scratched it. And um, and here is like little bags and scarves. And then my two favorite bags to tote around. And then a book bag if I need it. And then lanyards for Universal, Disney, and such like that. So this is the closet that I am very, very proud of. So much better. And the basket of cozy blankets is now time to vacuum the living room. I just vacuumed the bedroom. Larry, blah, Larry, what the heck was that? <laughs> Larry is putting away the dishes in the dishwasher and uh, just gonna tidy up a little bit. vacuumed 
And now I just wanna light a candle. I wanna light one of the new ones just to see what it smells like. And I also need to call my dad because, set you guys down for a second, I want to see Larry and I want to see if they want to do family dinner over here this weekend instead of us going over there. I'll give my dad a break from cooking and all of that. So we'll check that. I'm out of breath from vacuuming. It's a workout. All right, let's light Acorn Lane, shall we? All right, so I think I'm going to read my book, Midnight Sun, for a little bit. Call my dad first, read for maybe an hour or so, and then it'll be time for us to make dinner. I think I am going to end this vlog here because if I don't and I keep filming, I think it's going to be really long. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below, and we will see you guys again very soon. Bye. Say bye, babe. Bye, babe. Well, that didn't really work. You going? Go on. Careful. Ooh, okay. Uh, that'll do, donkey. That will do. I hit the button. <laughs> oh, I'm having fun, babe. Having a great time. Why? Please work. Just, just work with me, will ya? There we frickin' go! And that's how you do it. Although that looks dangerous. Okay! Tahitian vanilla pumpkin spice homemade marshmallow and drizzled... Dri oh my god. Let me just restart that, guys. Hold on. Okay, let's pretend we know how to speak <laughs> and pronounce. And it's... What's this color? I can't, I can't remember this. I'm Larry, blah, Larry, what the heck was that? 